McCallum looks up. Curler, cracking goal! Part of a new management setup, Danny Bloor is known to many around Eastbourne and not just at the borough. We caught up with Danny just before the big kickoff to find out more about him and his role at the club. Well, Danny, uh, welcome to the lane, I was going to say, but welcome back, of course, because uh, you did a few jobs in the past for, for Gary Wilson. Yeah, just uh, when, the, when the club had a side in the football combination, probably five, six, seven years ago now, uh, Gary just asked me to come in and help with that for a little while, uh, but at the Christmas time I was offered the post as Eastbourne Town Manager, so uh, I departed and it, obviously Eastbourne Borough is a club that uh, I've always followed uh, from a distance. If I were thinking Danny Bloor, the first thing I would think of is someone who really knows his Sussex football. Yeah, I mean, you know, still think to yourself, it's quite young, but none of us are getting any younger, Kevin. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I've, uh, I've been at a few clubs now, but I certainly think Eastbourne Borough is, uh, in my opinion, the third biggest and best club in the county. Have you got a job description? I'm just here to, I'm, you know, I think my title is assistant manager, but, you know, I've managed before on my own. I've been assistant to uh, our friend Gary Wilson and the former borough manager. So, and I'm just here to help assist Jamie and, you know, Jamie's the manager, but I'll be backing him 110%. We've uh, had a, a month or more of pre-season. How has it gone? I'm not a great lover of pre-season, if I'm honest with you, Kevin, because I think I've managed before, as I say, and I think sometimes you've gone in having very good pre-seasons and lost your first game, mm. and then other times you've gone in with not so good pre-seasons and ended up winning your first game. But I feel that it's gone well. Obviously, it's a new group, you know, a new manager coming in, new assistant manager, uh, Ian Simpemba stepping up to play a coach. So there's a lot of uh, new, new uh, things for the players to take on board. But generally, I think uh, you were at Lewis on uh, uh, the Saturday, you know, our last friendly, and I think there were promising signs. Yeah, I thought so too. And uh, I think it's an exciting style of play that, that Jamie wants to instil. And I'm sure you're on board with that. Absolutely. I mean, you know, if I was a, an Eastbourne Borough player, if I was an Eastbourne Borough fan, you know, I think it'd be, a, 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 you know, a pleasure to watch the way we're going to try to play. Um, it's not always an exact science, but, you know, we'll be trying to pass the ball and uh, hopefully it'll bring our just rewards. I'm sure the minimum every club wants at this stage is a sort of good, solid middle of the table and then look upwards how frightening can it get in terms of getting higher in the table well I think you just have to uh, get yourself rocking and rolling I'm sort of old enough and wise enough now to perhaps not make any predictions uh, we went up to watch uh, wedding player Millwall 11 on Monday evening Jamie and myself and uh, you know we're trying to get and have a look at the league because obviously uh, Jamie and I don't know the league particularly well but we, we, we find our feet and uh, we've got some good experienced players uh, a fair nucleus of uh, players who were here last season we've made some very good additions we feel um, and only time will tell but I, I'm not going to stand here and make any predictions we just hope that we can bring progress and sometimes it's how you judge progress it is uh, you know progress playing uh, an attractive style of football that can be uh, uh, derived as, pro as progress you know and it, it, time will tell. The Outside Danny Bloor is standing here nice and calmly and coolly and summing up the season. I reckon the inside Danny Bloor can't wait for Saturday. I'm looking forward to it now. As I say, I'm not a great lover of pre-season, but we're nearly there now. You know, we're nearly out of the traps. Uh, Saturday, we're at home to Braintree. We're, we do our work on them. And uh, let's hope we can get off to a good start. And then obviously we've got two tough away games, be uh, having a walk to Louisville on the Tuesday, then travelling to Hampton and Richmond, Alan Dowson's side on the Saturday before we return to Priory Lane to uh, play against Welling. As I say, we watched on Monday evening. So, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. It gets to this stage now. You want the, you want the race to start. Great stuff. Cheers, Thanks for so much, Any time.